Here's refreshment you can enjoy quickly and conveniently. In the 1950s, Coca-Cola was sold in glass bottles. The company would collect them, wash them and reuse them. These lighter plastic bottles take pounds off your shopping load. By the 70s, Coke was promoting plastic. Single-use plastic is just a massive money saver for all sorts of companies, including Coca-Cola. They use incredibly cheap plastic to make that packaging. They put it on the market and then it's job done. It's gone. In the last three years alone, 156 billion of Coca-Cola's plastic bottles have been littered, burned or dumped. But Coke knew it had an image problem, so announced a plan to recycle more bottles, called World Without Waste. But if you look at the small print, there's an admission. Their bottles are only recyclable where infrastructure exists. This is the Pacific island of Samoa. In February, Coke stopped producing glass bottles here and started shipping in thousands of plastic bottles. The population here in Samoa is only 200,000. We don't generate enough waste to have a recycling facility for plastic bottles here on the island. Coca-Cola has set up a scheme to pay people $1 for every kilo of plastic bottles they collect but so far, none has been exported for recycling. Halfway across the globe from Samoa is Uganda. Here, not enough bottles are being collected to meet Coca-Cola's recycling promises. Coca-Cola says they will collect one bottle for each bottle they sell in Uganda, but they can never do that, they can never achieve it. In the capital, Kampala, the recycling system largely depends on informal waste pickers. Most of them are single mothers with their children, earning around one dollar a day. Uh, The whole bottled drink sector has a recycling problem. But Coca-Cola is by far the biggest company, selling 3,500 plastic bottles every second. And nearly four years after making their World Without Waste pledge, our investigation has revealed that Coca-Cola is struggling to make the headway required to meet their green goals. Coca-Cola is an absolute master of greenwashing. Greenwashing is pretending that something is green when actually it is anything but green. And evidence from Break Free from Plastic suggests that more plastic Coke packaging is littered than any other brand. Coca-Cola say they're making good progress but have a long way to go, that they're campaigning to encourage recycling in Samoa and that they're working hard to help waste pickers. But if the biggest global plastic polluter doesn't reach its targets, the world's poorest will suffer even more. Sofia Betidza, BBC News.